What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. We are back playing some Paper Mario. In the last episode, we actually defeated the Sea Tower and the Tape Boss, destroyed the Purple Streamer, and now in today's video, we're going to be heading towards the Green Streamer. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys so much for the support. But we ended off at the top of this tower and... There are four little elemental signs, so we're going to be checking them out. Using our elemental powers, certain ones for certain things, and getting rolling with that. So we see some ice shell. We're going to burn that with some fire. Use the fire elemental, and I'm guessing we just have to use each of the elementals to hit all the buttons, and then maybe something happens. I don't know, but like I said, at the end of the last video, we defeat the purple streamer, so it showed us the green streamer, and the green streamer was straight up in the sky. So I don't know how we're going to get it. Like, you can see it right next to the firebird right now. It is straight up in the sky, so I don't know. How we're going to get up there, but we're going to find a way. We're definitely going to find a way. So, there we go. This one's open. There are little buttons on the side. Let me give a quick smack with the hammer. Give it a little bop over there. There we go. That's the fire elemental right there. Looking all spiffy. The fire elemental is chilling. We got that button. We got him in place. Let's go work on the other four. But it's so tough up here. Like, I love how they made the paper. Like, paper look like clouds. Like, it's just little, little paper spirals. Looking all dope. Here's the water elemental one. Bring it all out. Can I skip these little animations? I'm not trying to just watch them all. Oh, I can. I can. That's pretty tough. Oh, no. I can't really skip, like, the full animation. I just skip. Oh, no. I can. Okay, cool. So, there we go. I was going to say, I can only skip the Olivia animation. But, no. I can skip them both. So, that's pretty dandy. Saves us a little bit of time and we don't have to watch them all. Because we already know what it's doing. When I use the water elemental, it's a water thing. Breathe and water on into this thing. <laughs> like, it's pretty straightforward. But, there we go. Half them complete. Dude, the cloud's looking tough. Looking tough. Looking spiffy. Let's head over here. This one should be the, the earth one. Yeah. Which elemental power should we use? Let's use that earth elemental. And then the next one, we got to use the ice one to freeze the water over there. But get it. Let me skip this up. We already know you turn to that turtle. And then you do like a little like pom-pom dance. And you get it over with. I like how the earth elemental does that. <laughs> like, it's just it's a pom-pom dance. Like, who did this? Who did that? It's a giant turtle. Let's get rocking here. But yo, you guys know what game I've been rocking out with in, well, it's an iOS, it's a iPhone game. I've been playing Tiny Village, yo. That game has been so much fun. If you guys do not have Tiny Village, download it. It's a simulation game. You like build your village, all that cool stuff, and you collect dinos. But if you do have it, add me at jeans underscore YouTube or jeans underscore YT on Tiny Village, yo. That game rocks. Me and my whole family play it, and we just, like, battle. Well, we don't battle. We, like, compete to see who gets better dinos and all that stuff. It's just so much fun. I've been having a blast with it, but like I said, if you guys do have it, definitely add me over there. Jeans underscore YouTube. I would love to get some fans so I could send some tokens, all that good stuff in that game. But we use our last little elemental power right here. We are chilling, and we hit this last thing, and... Friday... Well, when am I recording this? It's Sunday right now, so this video will be out Monday, so at the end of the week, we got Super Mario 3D All-Stars coming out here. And I'm going to be doing a playthrough on 64 and Galaxy first. So stay tuned for that. And then eventually we'll get the sunshine. But, yo, hopefully you guys are hyped for that and show some support on that playthrough as well. But, yo, what is this? All the elemental powers line up. They create, like, some beam that's going straight up to the sky. I'm guessing that's how we're going to get up to the sky. That's pretty tough, yo. Dude, this game gets better and better. Like, we're going up to the sky now. Like, what more do you want? We're going to the clouds, man. This is going to be where the fifth streamer is. The fifth world. Because this playthrough is actually coming pretty close to an ending here. I think we only have a few more episodes left. But look at this. We're floating. We're floating. It's like a UFO is taking us up. Like, we're a cow. Like, you guys know that typical UFO, how they suck up cows. You just lay them up. <laughs> Could you imagine just being out on a farm and just seeing your cow just, like, get taken by a UFO? Like, oh, there goes Johnny. Yo, Johnny's out of here. He's getting taken by the aliens. <laughs> but up. Oh, whoa. The Shanker Spa, bro. The Shanker Spa. Looking spippy, dog. What is this place? It seems like we're pretty high up, but it's too cloudy to see much. Yeah, we can't see anything. But it's a spa, yo. There's a bridge, and there it goes to Green Streamer. So, obviously, we gotta go that way. Even if there wasn't a Green Streamer, Olivia, there's only one way to go. And it's across this bridge. And I'm taking it. If I made my way up here, I'm going across the bridge. Through the clouds. And what we got here? Oh, it's something. It's gonna be something cool. Is this a cafe? What is that? This is what the cafes look like. It's Paradise Found. Yo, that's pretty cool. Oh, yes, we found paradise. Woohoo! <laughs> Let's get it. Let's go inside. But it looks like how the, like, the Toad's Cafe usually looks. If we come over here, we got ourselves a nice little mystery block. Bop, bop. Give me some confetti. I'm full on confetti. This is like the first time in a while. Because I defeat the boss. Oh, baby, give me them coins. Thousand coins. I'll take that all day. I'll take it all day, baby. Oh, yo, dude, the Toads have angel wings, bro. They look at Spiffy. <laughs> Welcome, welcome to the Shangri Spa. Let's get it. Shangri Spa, that sounds amazing. This is supposed to sound like Shangri La. Isn't that like a 
like a holy thing or something. I don't even know. But the Shanker Spa, yo, we chilling here. I guess we're gonna talk to the main dude over here. What's goody? What's goody, man? Welcome to the Shanker Spa, Mario. Where it's a place for you to rest, reflect, and renew through the power of the hot springs. Okay. All right, sign me up. My mind and body could use all those things. The suggested donation and mission is a thousand coins. What you mean? That's why they gave us a thousand coins outside. So we can have a thousand coins to actually pay for this. Because you wouldn't want to come up here and have no coins and not have enough for it. That would be hilarious. So it says take this stamp card as well. Okay, so we get a stamp card. Visit all the hot springs to fill this out. Okay. I'm guessing we're going to have to do that. Get the stamps and all that stuff. You'll give me a special prize. Just remember to get your card stamped each time and then bring it back to me when you're done. That's it for me. I hope you enjoyed the Shangri Spa. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, I've been looking forward. All right, awesome. Let's go. Uh, where's the spot? Got a door over here. Let's get it. Let's get it to the spa, baby. Oh, sick. This is considered World 5. Okay, so here's the little uh, warp pipe. So this is World 5 out of 6. And I think World 5 is the last streamer, and then 6 will probably just be like the final boss fight and all that. Do we have anything like floating around here? Got these little things right here. Little toad statues that we've been seeing all throughout the Great Sea. And all out World 4. Uh, here's another road. Let's head over this way. Is this where the spa's at? Looking for the spas, man. Oh, yes, sir. Look what we found. Let's see what this says. Spring of purification. Effective against rips and tears. Okay. That's cool. Let's head inside of here. Look at this little Koopa Trooper chilling right there. It sure looks hot. Do you think it's one of the, the hot springs? It doesn't look very springy. Yo, we getting in here. Let's get up in there. Oh, we relaxing. We feeling good after a long work week. We feeling good in the spa. You're so brave, Mario. You just can't jump right in there with no regard. Oh, you get in here, Olivia. Seems like you're quite fine. Maybe even better than fine. Yeah, yo, we chillin'. Get in here, Olivia. Join us. We're looking spiffy. Fall in there. Just fall in there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We are in there like swimwear, baby. <laughs> Let's get it. Bro, I could totally go for a hot tub trip now. Or like a spa like this. On like a... Up on a mountainside. Bro, like, come on. And just relax and just... Like, usually when you're in, like, hot tubs, and you get to, like, that point where you just feel like, you you just feel like ooze. You feel like slime, where you're just like, bleh. <laughs> and you just, you're just dead. <laughs> well, let's check this toad right here. Oh, we got a stamp, which is awesome. So there we go. So I guess we got to find the other ones. What do we got right here? Oh, look at this. Oh, what is this hammer? Legendary hammer. That thing is crazy. The strongest and fanciest hammer in the game. Let's get it. But yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about. When you're in a hot tub for too long, you legit feel like you're melting. You're just like, bleh, I'm dead. I gotta get out. I can't feel myself anymore. <laughs> well, we come over here and, you know, look at this place. It's all, like, up in the sky. It's looking amazing. Well, this view is incredible. We're actually floating in the clouds, Mario. It's so nice. I could almost forget about the green streamer. No, don't forget about the green streamer. We gotta do that. But, yo, was that Bowser's castle? That's a Bowser's castle? What you mean? What you mean? I didn't know Bowser, I knew Bowser was in this game, but he was, uh, maybe they turned him to an origami, because I remember in, like, the beginning of the game, we, like, rescued Bowser when he was originally paper, but I think they got away with him, and Bowser Jr. did save us. Hey, Lord, as Lord Bowser's number one, I must face off against you. Yo, don't face off against me. You may heard of me, I am known as Kamek. Don't face off against me, you're not even origami, I'll just be your friend. Kamek's cool, though. I think Kamek's pretty cool. This Lord's Battle number one groundkeeper. I have the important information for you. What you got? What do you want to tell us? Oh, this was after. After escaping in the clown car, Lord Bowser returned to his castle where I awaited his command. Okay, so this is a story about it. Yo, look at the little, <laughs> the folded soldiers. But ju just as he arrived, we were overwhelmed by the folded soldiers. Bowser was captured again. Dun, 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 dun. I haven't heroically secreted myself during the attack. I was ready to engage in our emergency protocol. But the button I pressed shut off the airstrip engines and said it wasn't my fault. He pressed the wrong button, yo. What you mean? <laughs> but the engines off Bowser Castle plunged straight into the Shanghai Spa campus. And that's how it crashed there. Okay. Yeah, right into the banquet hall. Yo, look at my boy Toad. One must make a reservation to drop a castle on our banquet hall. Do you have any idea how far we're booked? <laughs> this Toad's not having it. He's pissed off, man. <laughs> And this guy, Kamek's raking over there, but this Toad's eye, he's like, I booked all like a week ago, and this thing drops on my hotel. I was playing a nice vacation for the fam, yo. And he just came out of nowhere just to say that. But, well, you heard the Toad, this is the state of Lord Bowser's minions, castle, and life. Also, that scary looking face, just part of Bowser's castle. Okay, that's fine. So maybe we gotta head over there, see what's going on. Can you stop talking to me like I'm over it? There you go, thank you very much. Oh, we gotta follow you? He's on the move. 
This way, Mario. There's no time for side quests. Okay, so we can't. I was gonna go see if there's anything back there. Let's go, Kamek. Let's get it. The green streamers look dope. I just want to surf on that thing. <laughs> Yo, this place is sick. Look at it. There's a spot up to the right, which I want to go to, but I probably can't. But this fountain's looking awesome. That fountain's looking amazing, dog. All right. I guess we're going up in the Bowser's Castle. No time for side quests, and Kamek said. Let's get it. Let's get it, dog. Here we go. Go right in, Mario. E -he -he. All right, let's get it to Bowser's Castle. Oh, this is going to be a fun video then. And of course, something happens. And of course, shouldn't have known better. And what is that? I forget what this uh, enemy's called. But yo, bruh, it's Thunderous from Pokemon. Coming out here, slapping on us, dropping some Thunderbolts. That confirms it. There's a really big lightning beast guarding the front door. I mean, you probably could have seen that. It's a giant cloud right above it. We would just looked up. We would have been like, bruh, giant lightning cloud blocking it. Dad. Yo, my boy, Bowser Jr. He's coming in here. Oh, it's young master Bowser Jr. I never seen him so happy to see Lord Bowser. Yo, what's goody? I miss my dude. We only saw him like back in episode two or one. I think it was one actually. Oh, well, yo, what you mean? Sisters are coming out? <laughs> they murdered him. <laughs> they just murdered Bowser Jr. They put like the red screen behind him and all. They murdered my dude. No. <laughs> Young master, your body, your clown car. He's still alive? He just got cut up. Scissors came out of nowhere. It's like, ching, 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 ching. See you later, fool. Murdered him, blood splattered on the screen. It's a night, night, dude. Banna, 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 banna. What I gotta do now? Yo, Kamek talks too much, man. I only, only met him like a minute ago, and he's been talking the whole time. He picks up all his body. Quickly, let's get young master shredded body to the spring of purification before the damage is in. Okay, so we were just at that spring, so we gotta go back to the one we were just at. Onward! Let's go, come back. Let me get a quick save real quick. Bop. Yes, sir. But I still gotta go to, like, all the other springs, too, to get my stamp thing collected. That's what I wanna do. But, for right now, we're, uh, we're just dealing with Kamek, man. Come on, Kamek. Hurry to the spring of purification. Yo, dude, I know. What do you think we're doing? Like how he, like how he jumps when I jump. It's pretty funny. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're back here. I guess we'll just uh, heal him up, my dude. We already got the stamp here. Oh, what you mean? There's enemies in here? What are these dudes doing? The charging chucks. No, don't tell me. They're reserved for the spring. We got charging chucks in here. And of course, what's good? We're shredded, all right? Yeah, I knew these were full of soldiers before they even turned around. They ain't fool me. But well, we're going up against charging chucks. I do have a legendary hammer that is not equipped, though. I was going to say, I should smack these boys up. And two shy guys joined the fun. Oh, three snippets, actually. Not shy guys. Three snippets. Okay. We got three ring moves. It's looking a little, a little tough here. We go here. All right, never mind. Uh, dude, what do I want to do here? Hmm. Give me the ring. Let's go here. Do that. We're not gonna get it. I'm just gonna have to do hammer. This is a tough puzzle, but I'll just line up here. To go with that. Line up locked. I'm gonna start slapping on these fools with hammers. I get three action. So I got a big hammer. I got a flashy hammer, yo. You guys are getting the flashy hammer. You guys right here are getting the flashy hammer. I ain't playing around. Get the flashy hammer on. A little bit of great shot. 25, so that's a heaping amount. Flashy hammer rocks. I wonder how much the legendary hammer does. Probably kills everything in like one shot. An excellent. 27 with no 1.5 multiplier. That's nutty. Give me my flash hammer again. I ain't playing around. Get it. Yeah. Give me great. 25 damage. See you later, shy guy. And Kamek going for magic. Oh! Kamek chilling them. Kamek doing work. Forward pass. Oh, yo, they throwing football's ass. And of course, when I'm recording this, it's Sunday. Like the first Sunday for the NFL season. <laughs> or versus charging chucks. Bam, bam. What you want, fools? Okay. I don't like, dude, this lineup's tough. Uh, we go here. Get a perfect lineup for the shy guys. There's three. I mean, I'll take that and just slap on all these fools. Instead of worrying about all that, let's get our flashy boots out. Take these guys out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Snippets are dead. They get them out of here. I'll load up on these guys with the boots. These guys should be dead after this. Actually, maybe not that one. Hopefully that one will 
the shy guy and the dead charge and chuck should be dead he's gonna get a magic burst see you later all right if you would hit the other one that would have been awesome got one more he's gonna throw me a pass yo hit me deep yo caught that one for the touchdown baby six points let's run it all right i'm just regular boots it because if he doesn't die then uh come just gonna hit him with the magic thing because he's already been hit by the magic thing already how much gold we getting not bad uh 470 hmm that was a tough puzzle the puzzles are getting a lot harder but there we go take him out extra coins in here let's get a uh, bowser jr up in here yeah can we just talk to him or do i have to stay still there we go if i stay still we'll get our health back and we'll start uh the purification process over here with my boy come back he just drops bowser jr in there bowser jr let's get it now young man should be sure to look or i don't even know what you said i clicked through it too quick but he drowns bowser jr dead forever and he comes back out but he's all wrinkly look at him all looking all good it wasn't me i didn't crash the castle this time i just came here to help my dad but the next thing you knew i was all cut up into pieces and what are what is he doing here are we about to fight because i'm always ready let's go <laughs> her name was olivia she she lived in strangler spa yo what's good we'll talk about olivia right that but okay so we got bowser jr already back here i know we still have to uh, check out the other spas and check out all the other spots in this uh, little Shangri Spa area. I'm ready to go. Kind of sick of Bowser Jr. Look at him, he's trying to fly away. <laughs> he can't do it. I love uh, Bowser Jr.'s little sounds he makes when he's talking. <laughs> oh man, the stump thing's busted. And so even though you're back into one piece, you're still too creased to fly. You're also wrinkled and filthy. I would hate to think what Lord Bowser would say about you in the state. Indeed, it seems like fine is still out of the question. Guys, the wrinkles and dirt and creases, they just soak away in all the hot springs, okay? Okay, so we gotta go. There we go. We gotta take Bowser Jr. alongside with us to all the hot springs. Then we'll get a prize and Bowser Jr. will be safe. So that's the plan. And we wrap him back up and come gonna carry him around. Alright, let's roll. Let's roll. Let's get it. Alright, so the next spot I saw was all the way back where we just came from. It was like up to the right. I believe so. I believe so. But we need four spots, right? We need, well, four spots in total. Well, three now because we just got that one, the purification one. We've been had that. We've been had that, dog. Yeah, this one's right up to the right. I see the little this, uh, the hot spring going out. It's good. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a little spiny. Thank you for helping me with that. I've been inside there for hours. Okay, cool. <laughs> I thought we were going to have to fight somebody. I was going to be like, no. It was good, shy guy. Hey, Mario, the Shanger Spa staff are actually serious about making us miners work off our debt. <laughs> we're selling one-of-a-kind item. No, I don't want it. Will you buy it? No. 10,000 coins? That's half my money. He says he's sick of his manual labor job. <laughs> They're working him. It's only 10,000 coins. What are you doing? No, I'm not buying that. Only 10,000 coins. Can we get the stamp? This is a stamp booth for us. So, so, so campaigns collect one from each stamp. Can I not get it yet? I guess I gotta go in the spa. Oh! Chill on me. Why is it so hot? Can I go back in? Chill on me! This thing's like pouring out water. Can I talk to this dude? Careful, careful. All right. What do I gotta do here? Why is it so hot? Oh, do I have to turn on the other one? Will the other one cool it off? Come here. Come here. How do I get this thing on? Gotta be a way to get this on. Hey, shy guy. Let me talk to you. Careful, I hear a lot more screaming than you expect at, the, at a hot spring. <laughs> What's over here? There's a ladder. Okay. Can I hit this down? No, I cannot. Let's climb up the top. Get up there, buddy. Hey, hey, hey. Anything up here? Oh, coins. And Koopa Troopa. What's goody? What's goody, Koopa Troopa? Let me talk to you. I clean the roof. Then I clean the coins. What's next, boss? Okay, that's fine. Can I hop down here? I cannot. I can't get down here. Can I hop off the front? I do like cannonball. Okay, so we can dive down here. Can I go around this back end? Yeah, now we're talking. I see a box. Can I break it? I cannot break the box. How am I supposed to get around this stuff? Can I hop over that little wall? Oh, now, now I'm thinking. Go here, run under this. I can. And what's down here? There's gotta be a button. Yo, chill on me. We gotta fix the pipe. We bopped on him though. He hit me for 16 with a hammer, but we did get a quick little bop skill on him. And we gotta fix that pipe over there. Get bop, dude. Show me an easy puzzle. Show me an easy puzzle. Um, ch ch can I figure this one out? Hmm. Let's see. This one's doozy. Try spinning this. Actually, hold up. We start off by doing this. And spinning you. I got one more ring move. Dang it, man. These puzzles. I 
I can't line up four with that. Hmm. Alright, uh. Let me try that. Let's go back here. Go here. Slide you over. All right, fine. You know that's fine. That's fine. We're bringing out the we're bringing out the flashy boots. Bringing out the flashy boots. You want the flashy boots, dog? I ain't playing around. We don't have the 1.5. Like I said, these puzzles are getting a lot harder, harder and harder every single time. Then we got flashy boot them up. I think regular boots should be able to actually take these guys out. I hope so. Probably gonna do like 15 damage, but still, we just did 20 something. 14. Yeah, it does take it out, so we don't have to waste any uh, damage on our uh, flashy boots. A Mexican with a little magic, and he pooped the bed. Yo, you out of magic? What you mean? Yo, what are you doing? Bro throw. Hey! <laughs> get blocked. Are these guys in, gonna do a bro throw as well? Oh, they just hucking hammers. Hammer throw, get out of my face. Yo, he killed the other brother. Which is actually kind of funny. Let's bring out my flashy boots. This should be able to kill him with the 1.5. What was it, 24 times 1.5? So 35 damage. Get out my face, dude. So not that hard of a battle. We're gonna get confetti here to fill up that blue pipe. And that will make it less hot. I'll just say, y'all eat. Did one do the trick? It does. Yes, sir. But now, blue shooting out there, and that should cool it down. A little bit of mixture action. And I should be able to hop right back up on here and wrap right back around. Yes, sir. And into the spring we go. So then two more to go, and then we'll collect our stamp after we get inside there. Let me in there. I like how all these little things have, like, little puzzles. All the, uh, all the little, uh, the spas, man. All right, Bowser Jr., get down there. Here I go. Clown car ball. <laughs> Get down there, man. So, trying to heal up here. I can't skip this cutscene, which is kind of lame. Because they talk a lot. And Master, is it working? My boys! Yo, his creases came out. Check me out. Flat as can be. Big improvement. Still a little dirty, yo. Still need to dress Young Master's crease and smudges, yeah. He got a lot of the creases out. He's, he doesn't look folded anymore. He just needs the smudges off of him. Alright, let's roll. Look at Olivia. Uh, did Olivia die? What's she doing? Oh, we had to get her out here? Her folds are starting to disappear. She's being... Yo, she's turning to regular paper? Oh, we have to fold her back? She's starting to turn flat. Yo, that's actually cool. I thought we wanted her flat. Wasn't she flat? No, she's originally an origami. Yeah, she can't be flat because that's how she was made. So she will never be flat. So we're going to keep an origami. She's looking good. Yo, Olivia, what's good? <laughs> Here, come back. Thank you so much for helping me refold. No problem, no problem. All right, so where are the other ones at? I need two more springs. And I do not know. I've got some ones on the, on to the... Oh, don't forget your stamp. Yeah, yeah, thank you so much. Good thing you reminded me. I would have forgot. Bop, give me that stamp. Good thing you reminded me, my dude. Ban it, dan it. Let's get it. Let's roll. All right, so two more spas that I need to find. A little bit of spa action. Um, hmm. One over here. Actually, there's a map in the front. I actually want to look at it. Because that should be able to tell me where exactly where the spas are at and uh, which way to go. Let's open this up. So, one straight down and then seven's all the way on the left and like a floating island. Okay, so let's head up this. Let's head down first and then we'll head up to the other side. Yeah, this toad, this toad fountain's tough. It's looking good. These guys are clean. This guy's yelling at him. Look at him. He's yelling at him. Yo, when you go up, he's acting all nice. He's like, oh, look at me. And then when you walk away, he's like, yo, get back to work. So, let's head down here. <laughs> what's going on so they do like manual labor stuff they force them to work and there's a little spot over here a little bit of 10 coin got here some more confetti and can i just hop in this spring there's a goop in there yo you don't want the smoke hmm, doesn't look that full especially a few pieces of flat i bet you there's like a bunch underwater they're all gonna come up let's see what did i tell you yo what did i tell you i saw that come from my way we got a wave battle now but it's just up against goopas which are pretty easy they're light work and that one has a elemental power. I want him. And this looks crazy, this lineup. Three moves. Hmm. There we go. No, is that not it? That's pretty close to it. I'll take that. That was close to it. And we lost the elemental power because we didn't get a perfect lineup. That's all right. Uh, 
Flashy Boots still, be, still should be able to take these guys out. These guys are light work without the 1.5. Get them out. Get them out. Get them out of here. Get out of here, Gooms. Get these Goompas out of my face. I should be able to just use like other boots. Do I have any other boots? I do not, of course. Oh, Shiny Iron Boots should, should be able to do the job, too. Because these guys are like first enemies we ever burst. We can just bop them. Yeah, because they, I, I think they can only take like 15 health or something along those lines. And shiny iron boots one more time. Then we're down to one. Maybe Kamek can pick up the KO. So then we can keep like a perfect bonus going. Give it to him, Kamek. Yes, sir. Smokes him with a 38. That a boy. Okay. Last wave here. And these guys look like they're lining up in a... Uh... No way. I should kind of know. Oh, this one's so simple. Oh, my God. Yeah. Okay. Regular hammer should just be able to bop them all out. I should be able to just finish this one off with regular hammers. These Goombas are easy. Get them out of here. Excellent. Bop, 24, dead. Oh, get out of my face. Next. Next up in line. We're going for three excellence in a row. The hat trick of excellences. No, I flubbed it. Man. <laughs> I tried, guys. I tried doing it for the online gaming community. The Jeans online gaming community. But it happens. But we did get a perfect thanks to Kamek, which is awesome. So we get a couple extra coins there. And we fill up this spa. The spa is open now. We're Bowser Jr. to get rolling inside of him. Alright, we're standing here for a little bit. Give me all that. Like, how it fills your HP back to full. Like, it's so relaxing. Yo, buddy, here goes nothing. I'm tired of looking like a wrinkly old grandpa. Yeah, get up in there. Get up in there. Olivia looks red. Yo, look at her. She's beet red. Why would she even come in here if she knows it unfolds him? Looking even better, dude. Now he just has a little bit of smudges. One more spot to go. We are chilling. Ben -a -ben -a -na -na -na. At the risk, something blah 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 blah. Chill on me. Chill on me. Alright, let's roll. Let's roll. One more spot, and then we're gonna be on our way. Out of here. That one looks like grape soda. That's pretty cool. That's pretty tough. Look, this toad John. Sir, don't forget your stand. Yo, dude, these toads rock. These toads rock. They always remember me. They're always reminding me, man. Like, if it wasn't for them, I would have totally forgot. Look at these Koopa Troopers, just hard at work, man. Even labor, scrubbing the floor with towels. Like, give them mops at least, you know? These dudes are working their tails off. Like, these guys, dudes are animals. <laughs> this dude's sweeping grass. What's he saying? I'm so sick of sweeping, I want to get back to my regular job of raking. You want to buy something? I can't, dude. I can't. I'm sorry. You guys are just going to have to do manual labor for the rest of your lives. <laughs> Should have went to college. Hear that, kids? Go to college. <laughs> we head this way. Is there, like, a little path over here? Oh, yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. Let's roll to the last spa. Oh, this one's looking awesome. I want to talk to this toad before we do go in there. There's a toad stuck in here. Look at this. Right here. Come here. Oh, it's a snippet. What's goody? I'm not shrinking. I just, uh, slip. Yeah, that'll play. <laughs> All right, cool. What's up? This one's like a jungle. Spring of Jungle Mist. Official path. Oh, it's a path. The Spring of Jungle Mist is one of our most secluded hot springs. Good luck and enjoy your soak. We're actually going to be... Taking this hot spring on in the next episode because I believe it is rather longer. It's, it isn't like the other springs where you just like walk in there and you take a spring. You actually have to take like a path to it. So that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.